God bless you. Invite everyone. Stay tuned for the hour of prayer. It's the first of the month, and it's time that we go before God. We ask you to invite everyone in. Amen. As we share with evangelist Melissa Batiste in prayer through the word of God. And we thank God for you. Make sure that you invite someone so they'll know that it's prayer time all over the world. Amen. God bless you. At this time, you are into the hands of evangelist Melissa Batiste. Be blessed. Grace and peace be unto you from our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. This is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. We thank God for another first day of the month, standing in the gap prayer. We are standing in the gap as intercessors for those that are going through, that are afflicted. And we thank God because this is an honor to be able to go to the throne of God on behalf of our brethren. Uh, just a couple of things before we get started. The first thing I would like to say is Apostle George Reynolds, we did get your prayer request. I also did get the unspoken prayer requests that have been uh, inboxed to me and text to me. Um, trust me, we are praying on your behalf. I won't call out those names, um, but as, a, uh, as far as Apostle George Reynolds, we know that God has given you assignment. We know that you are seeking his guidance and his counsel as to where it is and how it is he wants you to move. All I can say to you is to stay in the word, stay prayerful, and continue to fast. And God will give you those things that you are seeking him for. Don't give up. You're too late in the game to turn around now. So as we draw minds in, let us focus and let us keep in mind that the purpose of our prayer is to stand in the gap for those that are in need. We have several things that we want to pray about. Won't hold you long today. One of the main things is, uh, of course, the tragedies with the terrorist attacks. Children are being injured. Lives are being innocent. Lives are being taken. This needs our attention. This is not something that you just turn on and can turn off with the remote. This is something that calls our attention. We need to go to God. Those families that are bereaved, we need to go to God on their behalf. We want God to comfort them. We don't have all the answers, but we do know that our God does. And the word of God tells us constantly, all things work together for the good. Let us trust and believe that. Amen. As we draw our minds in and we focus on those that are in need, those that are bound, those that are sick, those that are shut in, let us remember our brethren. Let us pray with one voice, with one mind. Righteous Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, we thank you for this day, yet another first day of the month, Lord God, to come to you, Lord God, like only we know how, humbly, Lord God, bowing our heads in humble submission unto you, O oh God. Lord God, asking you, Lord God, to help us. Lord God, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this moment. We thank you for this hour. We thank you for having a mindset, Lord God, to want to call on you. We thank you for having a mindset, Lord God, to want to come to you, Lord God, to seek your face, to seek your will concerning not only our own lives, Lord God, but the lives of our brothers and our sisters, Lord God. We thank you for that right now in the name of Jesus, Lord God. We thank you for knowing that you are a God that is sitting high, but you're looking low. We thank you for knowing that you are a God whose ear is not too heavy, that you cannot hear our cries and our supplications unto you. We thank you for that right now in the name of Jesus, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for knowing Lord God, that our steps 
are ordered by you that as long as we desire to be inside of your will you shall and you will order our steps we thank you for that right now in the name of jesus lord god we thank you lord god for having a made up mind to run on and see what the end of this race is going to be we thank you lord god for having a made up mind to fight on to press on to keep on keeping on we thank you for that right now in the name of jesus lord god <clears throat> lord god we ask right now that you forgive us. Forgive us of those things knowing and unknowing. Those things confessed and unconfessed. Forgive us right now in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Lord God, we ask that those of us that need it, create in us a clean heart and renew the right spirit within us, Lord God. <clears throat> Give us a heart of flesh, Lord God, not a heart of stone. Lord God, touch our mind. Touch our spirits, Lord God. Strengthen our minds. Strengthen our spirits. Strengthen our hearts, Lord God. Strengthen us, Lord God. Give us the made of mind to come to you, those that are lacking faith, Lord God. Encourage them right now in the name of Jesus. Those that are going through, Lord God, encourage them right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, those that are sick <clears throat> on their bed of affliction, your word tells us that many are the affliction of the righteous, but you shall deliver us from them all. Deliver the afflicted right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, we ask that you bless them right now in the name of Jesus. Anoint them, touch them right now in the name of Jesus. From the crown of their head to the sole of their feet, Lord God. Those that are shut in, Lord God, for whatever the reason. Whether it be because they're behind prison walls, whether they be because they're disabled, whether they be because they're on their sick bed, we want you to bless them, Lord God. Heal them, but don't just heal them. Heal them and make them whole, Lord God. Make them whole, Jesus, so that, Lord, they come with a testimony of praise. <clears throat> Lord, we thank you right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, we ask that not only... Do you bless those that are sick or shut in? Also, Lord, bless the caregiver. A lot of them, Lord God, they don't have rest. Yes. They can't sleep at night. In the name of Jesus. Because they have to get up. Yes. And they have to care for the one that is sick. In the name of they Jesus. They have to make sure, Lord God, the medicine is on time. My God. They have to make sure, Lord God, that they're stimulating those that are sick. Yes. They have to make sure, Lord God, that they're hydrated, Touch them, that Lord. the medical needs, the doctors are pointing. In the name of Jesus. And everything is being sought after, Lord God. Yes, Lord. It's not easy. Yes, Lord. Especially when you're caring for a loved one. In the name of to Jesus. To see them in a position, Lord God, that you're not used to seeing them Say in, Lord God. It's not Jesus. easy. So yes. we ask right now in the name of Jesus. Yes. That you bless the caregivers yes. right now, Lord God. Yes. Strengthen their mind. Yes. Strengthen their body. Yes. So that they can care for those that are sick and shut. In the name of Jesus. Right now in the name of Jesus. Yes. Lord God, I ask that you send for deliverance. Yes. Those that are disabled. Yes. Not just the wheelchair bound, but bless them. Yes. Bless the ones that are wheelchair bound. Ah. Bless the ones that are bedridden. But Lord, also. Those that are disabled in their mind. In the name of Jesus. Whether it be emotionally, yes. mentally, or spiritually. Hallelujah. Those disabled in their mind Hallelujah. and the mental Hallelujah. and the Hallelujah. spiritual. Hallelujah. Bless them right now in the Touch name right of now, Jesus. Cancel the assignment of yes. the death in the name of Jesus. Enemy Release alive. the minds yes, right Lord. now in the name of Jesus. In the name Release of Jesus. the spirits Do right, right now, now in the God. name of Jesus. Yes. Mm. Allow a new praise ah, yeah, to be in their lips mm. yes. right now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord God, those are, are bound, Lord God. Do it right bound now, God. to addiction, yes. bound to fear, bound to guilt, yes. bound to insecurity, yes. Lord God. Mm. Release the bondman mm. right mm. now in the mm. name of Jesus, yes. Lord. Allow their eyes to be open, yes. Lord. Yes, yes, yes. That they can see the open doorway for them, Lord God. Yes. And allow them the strength to run through it and be free mm. in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Bless right now in the name of yes, Jesus. Yes, 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 yes. There oh. are some, Lord God, many, not some. There are many, Lord God, yes. that are bound in their finances. In the name Lord. of Jesus. Speak 
speak increase yes. and overflow. Yes, yes, the yes. The name of Jesus. Yes. We loose increase Ooh, devil. and overflow in the name of Jesus. Loose it in the name of Jesus. Yes, yes. We loose your finances. Ah, Jesus. Yes, in the name of Jesus. God, when you release yes. these finances, right Lord now. God, give us a mind. Bless right now, Jesus. Good stewards over our finances. Yes. In the name of in the Jesus. name of Jesus, we know that you can't allow things to happen if we're not going to be good stewards yes, over God. it. Yes, so we God. ask, Lord God, release the finance, yes, God. release the bond, the yes, bondage God. from the finance. Yes, God. And also, release the mind, Lord God, yes, Lord. to be good stewards yes, Lord. over the finances in yes, the name Lord. of Jesus. Lord God, I ask that you release those that are abused, yes. whether it be physically, mentally, or yes. emotionally. Yes. Lord God, give them the strength to in look the at the man in the mirror and love that one yes, man Lord. or woman in the mirror. Yes, Lord. Allow them to love themselves in the enough, name of Jesus. Lord God, to say, I can do bad uh, yeah. all by myself. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. free them yeah, in yeah, the yeah. name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The that, held, that holds them bound. Yes. Free them from their abusers Freedom right God. now. Those that are holding on Freedom, to God. be abused in their past, yes. release their mind yes. in the name of Jesus. Freedom, God. I speak right now in the Ooh, name of Jesus. Shot. Let it go and be free. Yes. Be free. Be free and yes. be in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Release it. Release it right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Let it go and allow yourself to be free in the name of Jesus. I speak, Lord God, on behalf of those that are married. I ask that you bless the covenant of the marriage, Lord God. Lord God, we ask that you come against the enemy that is trying to destroy the unity of husband and wife right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, we ask that you stir up a new love, stir up a new intimacy, stir up a new closeness, Lord God. You already told us that whoever that you have joined together, let no man put asunder. So, Lord God, we come against anything that is going against the marriages, Lord God. And we ask that you strengthen them in the name of Jesus. Lord God, we ask that you bless the parents, whether they're two-party parents or single parents, Lord God, our children are in need of a village. And we ask right now, Lord God, that you give us a mindset to train up our children in the way that they should go so that when they are old, they will not depart from it in the name of Jesus. I cancel every assignment that the enemy has against our children. Our children shall rise up. Our children shall grow up. Our children shall be free and safe to live in the name of Jesus. Release them right now. Protect our children as they go to school yes, yes. while they're in school in coming from Jesus. school protect them in their homes yes. lord god we had so many reports yes. of how children are laying in their beds yes. at night and cars are running into the homes mm. protect our children protect them, in god. the name of jesus yes. lord god. in the name of jesus lord god lord god we ask that you save souls save the sinner man Show him you. Show her you. Bring her unto you. But Lord God, we also, uh, we also ask that you allow us, Lord God, to be that witness, Lord God, that will help to draw men unto you, Lord God. Allow us to have the mindset, Lord God, to tell the good news about you, Lord God, mm. so that men and women will thirst after you, run to you, hunger for you, in the name of Jesus, Lord name God. Jesus. Don't allow us to be stumbling blocks for our fellow man, Lord God. Don't allow us to kill the witness on the inside of us. Allow us to allow the, the spiritual man to live and to be bold and to be confident so that we can draw others unto you. There is indeed a need. The harvest is indeed plenteous. And we understand that the laborers are few, but they're there, Lord God. Allow us to recruit laborers, Lord God, for your kingdom, Lord God. Give us that mindset and that strength, Lord God, and that courage and that confidence, Lord God, to call men and women unto you in the name of Jesus. Name of now, Lord God, you promised that you were married to the backslider. Slider. There are some out there that have turned away from you. For whatever the reason, it does not matter. But you are married to the backslider. Bring them unto you. 
call them unto you. I hear in my mind the song, Hezekiah Walker, you're calling my name. She goes on and she says, Lord, I have sinned, but yet you're still calling my mm. name. Call the people unto you, Lord God. Allow their ear gates to be open yeah. so that they can Shut hear up. you clearly, Lord Shut God. Up. And Shut allow up. their hearts to be conditioned Shut so up. their answer will be, here I am, oh God. Here I am, oh God. Bring your people unto you in the name of Jesus. Lord God, I take out this time now for the church, yes. the bishops, yes. the pastors, the ministers, the evangelists, the missionaries, the leaders, Lord God. Lord God, we need to get on one accord with one another and so that we can go out and advance your kingdom, yes, Lord, God. God. Pray, God. Lord God. Pray, Lord God, bless, bless yes, our bishops, yes. bless our past, anoint our bishops, anoint our past. Lord God, send forth a fresh anointing upon them so that they will be able to lead their people your sheep, lead their flock, Lord God, so that you will be pleased and you can come back for a church, a church without spot or wrinkle, Lord God. Bless our country. Bless the leaders of our country. Bless our nation. Bless the leaders of our nation. Lord, we are in turmoil. We are in warfare and we need your help right now in the name of Jesus. Send forth your warring angels. Send forth your ministering angels. Allow them to encamp around your people, Lord God, because we need you like never before. Your word is true and the signs are among us. And we see clearly that your return is sooner than ever. And we thank you. But Lord God, there are souls out there that are lost and we don't want anyone to go to hell that don't choose to go to hell. So allow us, Lord God, to reach each and every soul that we possibly can in the name of Jesus. Allow your people, Lord God, to understand that now is the time. You don't have years from now. Now is the time. Now is the moment. Now is the hour. Choose ye this day whom ye will serve. Bless your people. Oh God, help your people, oh God, teach your people, oh God, lead your people, oh God, help us to turn, help us to lean and depend slow, solely on you. No one else but you, oh God, no one else but you, oh God, Lord God, stir up the gifts within us and allow us not to hoard them to ourselves, but to use them for your glory and for the edification of your kingdom. Lord God, bless your people. Keep us, lead us, and guide us. These blessings we ask in your son Jesus' name. In your son Jesus' name. Jesus, Jesus. All Amen. 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 We always like to leave our monthly into standing in the gap intercessory prayer with what we call our focus for the month. So the prayer needs to continue every day, every day. We, we beseech you, I beseech you, my brethren, to go before God every day, not just for you, but for someone you don't even know. And so our focus for this month is, of course, our homeless brothers and sisters. Also, our shut-in brothers and sisters. And then also those who are victims of the terrorist. So we want to focus on those things this month. And also, of course, we want to continue to focus on advancing the kingdom of God. We thank you so much for joining us in prayer. We thank you. And we look forward to July 1st. We look forward to coming together again and praying to God with one spirit and one accord. Until next time, be encouraged and know that you're blessed. You have been on tonight with evangelist Melissa Batiste and the hour of prayer every first of each month. We thank God for you, for God is truly moving. Invite someone each month 
talk to someone. You can also subscribe at Real Talk Broadcast Network where evangelist Melissa Batiste can be heard praying to God because we know prayer to God changes things. Be blessed.